Lorunt is our local crack. It's really close from our home. Um, this place is quite historic. The roots here are pretty old, like about 30 years old. And uh, back in the days, it was already a meeting point from the local climbing community. And nowadays it's the same. So we are really happy to have this place around. It's, it's super beautiful here and uh, we love the climbing and uh, spending time together with friends. The crack is based directly in the forest, so it's really beautiful. You have a lot of trees around and a lot of different uh, walls, so you can find uh, really bouldery roots, but also super long bumpy lines. And unfortunately, this crack is in danger. Sprengstoff is an old uh, Kammerlander project for already 30 years and last year in November Jacopo came and uh, did the first ascent finally <laughs> and uh, it's pure power endurance and this, this is uh, the coolest thing about the route. When I moved here I always heard about this uh, like Lorunzer project was the project in Vorarlberg. And at this time, for me, it was pretty clear that it's too hard. The hardest uh, single sequence was at the first part of the line. It was a really hard gas stone move and I had to invest uh, three whole days to just work on this sequence. And yeah, at the end the cracks uh, changed for me because the real cracks on my sending tries were on the very top, so on the really last part of the line. <laughs> I fell off again and again and for me it was a really hard mental game on the very last part. I decided to call the route Sprengstoff, uh, which means explosive in, uh, in German, um, because the entire like climbing area is uh, really close to a quarry, and there is the possibility that in the future years uh, they'll decide to blast all the of like part of the crag. This crag is in danger. It's on the property of the quarry and. We already experienced back in the days that uh, they destroyed a part of a wall on the lower sector and nowadays we are uh, pretty afraid of that we are losing the whole place, that we can't climb here anymore in the future. And I think the proof that this place is really nice is that uh, not only the climbers like it, but uh, for example if you hike on top of the main sector you can find some archaeological finds which means that people were here, spent time here even like uh, ages ago. For us, uh, Lorenz is a very uh, special place and we really enjoy the time up here. And it would be so sad if uh, 
the quarry would destroy the whole area. So I really hope for the future that uh, we can still climb here and also that the next generations of climbers will spend a great time up here. There's also a second, uh, a second meaning because it's a really power endurance route. Your uh, forearms, when you're uh, at the top, they're really about to, to explode. So I kind of like this uh, like double meaning of the, of the name. The best thing about uh, such a project is uh, that you wake up every single morning fully motivated to get to this place and uh, try this route and just keep, give your personal best. And uh, that was really motivating to me, the whole process. It's not uh, like that you're just waiting for the day when you send the route. It's uh, a lot about the process, the little steps to get further on the project and to see the progress from can't doing a single move to connecting uh, the whole line.